All right, time to head back up to Door County. Wait till you see the caramel apples we found. Well, actually, they've got a lot more than just caramel. They are unbelievable. I don't think you could eat one yourself, but they're great to slice up and serve at a dinner party. Just something fun, and, and that way you don't have to do dessert. Definitely worth the trip. Let's uh, check out the Door County Confectionery and, and their gourmet caramel apples. Well, originally, Judy Dolman was the creator of Door County Confectionery opened up her first store in 1972 and from there she expanded up and down the peninsula increasing her stores and I believe in 19 in the 1993 then she bought the old dime store here and put all the chocolate making in the back. I believe we have 38 39 little treats that we make here right in the store. Uh, our most popular item is the bear paw and the cubby. Our caramel corn is quite popular. We make uh, the plain, the peanut, and then we also drizzle the plain with chocolate. Um, actually, uh, our caramels, we have like, we have licorice, chocolate, cherry, pecan, plain, mocha, coffee. Uh, we have a lot of different varieties and they're quite popular also. Caramel apples have been going on for years. Uh, Sue Zeller, who is the manager, um, likes, and I believe Judy did too, the Granny Smith. It has a long shelf life. It's crisp and, and sort of basically slightly sour on the inside. Uh, we use those and we make the Daffy, which is dipped in caramel first, pecans, and then drizzled with chocolate. Uh, the plain also, and peanuts. And then we do different little things, throwing on jimmies, M&Ms, we're doing caramel corn for the Halloween season, so uh, in a normal day, we would do like 300 apples at a crack. We carry a lot of old candy, you know, the hard candies, a lot of candies from way, way back. Uh, people like it. In fact, in the back, we do all our chocolates by hand. We put the caramel, and the uh, chocolate on the cubby in the paw with just a tablespoon. Uh, we make our bark with pouring it into the pan and just using our hands and throwing the almonds in. Uh, but no, basically, I, I don't want to say we're primitive, but yes, in a way we are. People like to view the wind through the window and see us doing it by hand, and I think that's how we will stay until the end. The kids love it. They get all excited. The parents sort of hold them back a little bit because, you know, they start to on the shopping cart. But they're very excited, and we do tours for children to come in, and we let them dip pretzels, uh, do small little things. But kids love it.